Changes could soon come to downtown Norfolk after recent crime on Granby Street. City Council discussed curfews and even a gun-free Granby Street. Tonight, Dan Kennedy continues his survey of downtown business owners and what they believe is the best solution. 40 downtown business owners answered our survey when it comes to improving safety on Granby Street. We told you last night that many are concerned about losing business. Some have even considered moving. Tonight, we focus on what they think is the solution. Weekend nights on Granby Street now come with more police patrols. The Norfolk Police Department made this shift despite being short more than 200 officers. Our survey asked if participants thought an enhanced police presence would help curb crime on Granby Street. The answer was an overwhelming yes. 77% strongly agreed. Another 15% agreed. One business owner suggested not the police officers we typically think of, more of nightlife ambassadors. We asked if business owners would support metal detectors or pat downs for their customers. Responses were about split. 53% disagreed or strongly disagreed. 39% either agreed or strongly agreed. One person said, close businesses that feel they have the need to have armed security and the need to search their customers. Then there's the contentious issue of closing businesses at midnight. The majority disagreed that a midnight curfew would make a difference, while 38% either agreed or strongly agreed that it would. One business owner said, it's just a Band-Aid and it's a terrible look for tourism. Another pointed out that violence can happen any time of the day. Guns fire 22 other hours a day. Jim Manning, the owner of the late night club Bugatti's, agrees, saying early curfews are unfair to businesses that follow the rules. You might as well close the place down completely because uh, the majority of the revenues is accrued between uh, 11 and 2. But Manning, like other business owners we surveyed, agree city leaders must address the violence somehow. I think some of them need to be closed, but not a not a uh, blanket everybody. In Norfolk, Dan Kennedy, 13 News Now.